The Science of Being Well by Wallace D. Wattle. Chapter 10 continued, It is not necessary to worry about a varied diet so as to get in all the necessary elements. The Chinese and Hindus build very good bodies and excellent brains on a diet of few variations, rice making almost the whole of it. The Scotch are physically and mentally strong on oatmeal cakes, and the Irishman is husky of body and brilliant of mind on potatoes and pork. The wheat berry contains practically all that is necessary for the building of brain and body, and a man can live very well on a mono diet of navy beans. Form a conception of perfect health for yourself, and do not hold any thought which is not a thought of health. Never eat until you have earned hunger. Remember that it will not hurt you in the least to go hungry for a short time, but it will surely hurt you to eat when you are not hungry. Do not give the least thought to what you should or should not eat. Simply eat what is set before you, selecting that which pleases your taste most. In other words, eat what you want. This you can do with perfect results if you eat in the right way, and how to do this will be explained in the next chapter. Chapter 11. How to Eat it is a settled matter that man naturally chews his food. The few fattists who maintain that we should bolt our nourishment after the manner of the dog or and others of the lower animals can no longer get a hearing. We know that we should chew our food. And if it is natural that we should chew our food, the more thoroughly we chew it, the more completely natural the process must be. If you will chew every mouthful to a liquid, you need not be in the least concerned as to what you shall eat, for you can get sufficient nourishment out of any ordinary food. Whether or not this chewing shall be an irksome or laborious task or a most enjoyable process depends on the mental attitude in which you come to the table. If your mind and attitude are on other things, or if you are anxious or worried about business or domestic affairs, you will find it almost impossible to eat without bolting more or less of your food. You must learn to live so scientifically that you will have no business or domestic cares to worry about. This you can do, and you can also learn to give your undivided attention to the act of eating while at the table. When you eat, do so with an eye single to the purpose of getting all the enjoyment you can from that meal. Dismiss everything else from your mind and do not let anything take your attention from the food and its taste until your meal is finished. Be cheerfully confident, for if you follow these instructions, you may know that the food you eat is exactly the right food and it will agree with you to perfection. Do you agree or disagree with the author? Have you enjoyed this video? Can you tell I'm reading it without my teeth then? Let me know in the comments below. Also, if you enjoyed it, your friends may enjoy it as well. Let them know about it by liking and sharing this video as it helps grow the family. And as always, to be sure you never miss one of these videos, please click the subscribe button. You need to subscribe to this channel. You need to subscribe to this channel. You need to subscribe to this channel. Subscribe to the Artistic Biker now. Click the buttons.